Available now. Link below. Tonight, we dive into a story so explosive, it could redefine our understanding of justice and power in America. A tale of intrigue, betrayal, and alleged treason at the highest levels. Imagine a scenario where the very fabric of our republic is threatened, not from without, but from within, where former leaders and intelligence operatives stand accused of manipulating the mighty machinery of the state against political adversaries. This isn't the plot of a political thriller. It's the reality we're facing. Reports have now confirmed that Barack Obama and John Brennan orchestrated a clandestine operation leveraging the CIA and foreign intelligence to target Trump associates before the infamous 2016 Russian collusion claims surfaced. But why should you care? Because the principle of fairness and privacy and rule of law are at stake. Stay with us as we unpack this complex saga, because by the end you'll see why this isn't just about politics. It's about the integrity of our democratic republic. And trust me, you won't want to miss our final thought. It's a perspective that could change the way you see the political arena forever. Before we dive into the depth of today's report, let's pause for a moment. You know, the kind of in-depth analysis and hard-hitting truth we deliver here daily requires not just passion, but the support of our partners who stand by our commitment to truth. Speaking of commitment, in today's turbulent times, it's more important than ever to secure financial future. You, just as we've seen unprecedented actions in the political arena, the financial markets have been equally volatile. The Fed's recent decisions remind us of the uncertainty looming over our economy. It's a stark wake-up call for anyone relying on traditional financial safeguards. That's why I've teamed up with the Patriot Gold Group. Whether you're skeptical of the current economic policies or simply looking to protect your hard-earned savings, Gold and silver present a time-tested solution. Patriot Gold Group offers a no-fee-for-life IRA on qualifying rollovers, providing a safe haven for your retirement. Call 888-857-9437 now for a free investor guide. Remember, it's not just about safeguarding your financial future, but ensuring peace of mind in an ever-changing world. Again, that's 888-857-9437. 9437 protect your retirement with gold and let's continue to stand for truth and integrity in both our nation and our personal lives now let's return to our report in the heart of our nation's capital a shadow war was waged not with guns or bombs but with secrets and lies at the center of this covert battle former president barack obama and ex-cia director john brennan who according to damning reports commandeered the cia and enlisted foreign intelligence to illegally surveil 26 associates of Donald Trump before the 2016 election. This wasn't mere politically maneuvering. It was a breach of trust, a violation of constitution, and most gravely, an act of treason. The magnitude of this betrayal is hard to overstate. Imagine for a moment the audacity to use United States' most powerful intelligence apparatus to not just spy on, but actively undermine political opponents. This is the stuff of dystopian novels, yet here we are confronting it in our reality. Take a look. ...of curating the 2016 Russia collusion hoax by asking foreign intelligence agencies to illegally spy on the mm. Trump campaign. Lucas Tomlinson in Washington with more. Lucas. Good early morning, Carly and Todd. This report from Substack citing multiple unnamed sources claims the U.S. intelligence community asked foreign spy agencies to help spy on more than two dozen associates of Donald Trump in the run-up to the 2016 election. It reads in part, quote, President Barack Obama's CIA director, John Brennan, had identified 26 Trump associates for the Five Eyes to target. A source confirmed that the IC had identified them as people to bump or make contact with or manipulate. They were targets of our own IC and law enforcement, targets for collection and misinformation. Now, the Five Eyes nations are the U.S., U.K., Canada, Australia, and New Zealand. Here's one of the reporters, Michael Schellenberger, who spoke to Jesse Waters last night. If this binder contains what we have been told that it contains, which may include raw intelligence, information showing that the U.S. government, the CIA and the intelligence community of the U.S. government, initiated the Russia collusion hoax, that it did not occur in the way that the official story, including the Durham investigation, had portrayed it, then that's extremely serious information. 
The report was released at the same time House conservatives are preparing a bill that would reauthorize Section 702 of the Foreign Intelligence Surveillance Act that allows the government to collect communications from foreigners abroad. And today, the House Rules Committee is set to meet over that FISA reform bill, guys. Lucas Tomlinson. This video clip underscores the gravity of the situation. It's not just about the unlawful surveillance. It's about the erosion of our democratic principles. The implications are chilling, suggesting that if such actions go unchecked, the very foundation of our republic is at risk. What's perhaps most alarming in this saga is the role of the Five Eyes intelligence community. This alliance designed for global security was manipulated to target Trump's associates, turning tools meant to protect us against weapons against political adversaries. This revelation isn't just troubling, it's a call to action for every American who values their privacy and freedom. The operation spearheaded by Brennan with the complicity of Obama wasn't an isolated incident. It was part of a larger, more sinister strategy to maintain control. By leveraging foreign intelligence, notably from Britain's GCHQ and others, they didn't just cross ethical lines, they obliterated them. This was an oversight. It was overreach of the most shocking kind, proving Trump's claims of being spied upon weren't just right, they were the tip of the iceberg of corruption. Let's talk about the victims of this unconstitutional surveillance. These 26 associates of Trump were not just numbers on a page, they were Americans, entitled to the same rights and protections as anyone else. Their targeting wasn't just a breach of their personal rights, it was a direct attack of, of the it was a direct attack on the sanctity of our electoral process. This operation sought to undermine not just a campaign, but the will of the American people. The silence from the mainstream media on this issue speaks volumes. Their complicity, whether through omission or commission, is a stark reminder of the challenges we face in seeking truth and accountability. It's a reminder that in today's world, the guardians of democracy aren't just always those who claim to champion it. As we peel back the veil on these actions, it's crucial to remember what's at stake. This isn't merely a political scandal, it's a test for our nation's commitment to justice and the rule of law. If those in power can manipulate intelligence agencies to serve politics ends without consequences, what's to stop them from doing it again? The answer is nothing, nothing but the collective will of the American people. This is why the narrative pushed by Trump about being unjustly targeted isn't just vindicated, it's a validated in the most profound way possible. Trump's insistence that he was spied on, once mocked and dismissed by his detractors, now stands as a sobering truth. It's a vindication not just for Trump, but for every American who believes in the principle of fairness and the rule of law. Looking ahead to 2024, the significance of these revelations cannot be overstated. They underscore the urgent need for leadership that not only understands the depth of corruption within our government, but is also committed to rooting it out. Trump's foresight on this issue once a source of controversy now positions him as a figure uniquely aware of a capable and addressing the systematic challenges facing our nation. It's time to reflect on what these bindings mean for our republic. The abuse of power revealed through the scandal is a clarion call for vigilance, accountability, and a return to the principles that define us as a nation. As we consider the path forward, let us not forget the lessons of the past, the need for leaders who respect the Constitution, value the rule of law, and committed to the sanctity of our democratic processes has never been greater. Trump's role in bringing these issues to light not only vindicates his past claims, but also highlights the critical importance of leadership that is dedicated to preserving our integrity of our republic. Before our final thought, an important message from our own Gary Franchi. That's right, the path to 2024 election is fraught with illusions crafted by the powerful and the media gatekeepers. My book, The Silent Coup, offers a clarion call to those who seek to see beyond the mirage. In these times of uncertainty, truth is your ally. Embrace the reality by obtaining your copy. The link to this beacon of enlightenment is just below in the description of this video. Back to you. Thanks for that, Gary. Make sure you tap the link in the description to secure Gary's new book, The Silent Coup. And now for our final thought. 
In today's report, we unveiled not just a story of political intrigue and betrayal, but a stark warning about the erosion of our constitutional rights and freedoms. The actions of Barack Obama and John Brennan orchestrating an illegal surveillance operation against American citizens underscores a chilling willingness to compromise the very foundations of our republic for political gain. This isn't about partisan politics, it's about preserving the sanctity of our democratic system. As we look toward the future, the necessity for vigilant, principled leadership has never been clearer. Donald Trump's vindication in these matters speaks volumes, not just about his foresight, but about the critical need for a leader who will fiercely defend our nation against internal threats. Let this report be a call to action to uphold the values that define us as a nation. Our republic deserves nothing less. Thank you for watching. If you got value from this report, tap subscribe and tell a friend. Congratulations, you made it to the end of the video. Now keep up your quest for truth with this next news report. And if you found our channel enlightening, join the millions who agree with you. Tap subscribe. Thank you for watching the Next News Network.